Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Wristwatch Wednesday. Just a quick one today on how to remove these snapbacks. Some of these snapbacks may have a little mark to indicate where to pry. You can see this one I've scratched up a lot trying to pry it off. Or some of them will even have just a little bump out. That may be hard for you to see since everything's silver right there that you can just grab a hold of and pry open. Now there's several different tools you can use to do this. Some specifically made for this and some that you can improvise. Uh, let me show you some of the ones made for this. Um, this is a watch back tool, a snapback tool. This is another one that's more like a knife, uh, so you be careful with So really, if you have a, a knife or a thin butter knife or anything, even, even a little regular screwdriver, you can get these backs off. And uh, just let me show you how easy this is. Um, you just get your little pry tool in there. Let me make sure you guys are still in view. You get your little pry tool in there and you just got to get it underneath to pry it up. Now this one, you got to be careful with. You don't want to cut yourself. Now this one, again, you got to be careful with. You'll jab yourself and you'll mark up your watch like I've done here. But you just get it underneath and do a twist on the back. It's hard to do with that camera in the way. But you can see right here is my little piece that's indent it out. Let me see if I can get, get you close to that. Indent it out. That doesn't make much sense, does it? This is the piece that sticks out right here. It's just, you can barely see that it it's just a little piece to grab onto with that pry tool. Anyway guys, that's how you do it. Now for the hard part. Now the hardest part could be getting it back on. Many of these you can just push back on with your with your thumbs. Sometimes you'll have to get your watch press tool out to do it, or maybe you just need to get your um, get your band out of the way and push it down. Now, here's here's something for you. A lot of these, a lot of these will have a little uh, indent right here for the crown, uh, the little crown stem right here. So you may have to line that up. So keep an eye out for that. This one does not. So what we're going to do here is just try to get this back on by hand. There we go. You can hear it snap. That's when you know you got it. And then just give it a good look around the edge and make sure that it's uh, good to go. But anyway, guys, quick one today. Removing snapbacks is not that hard. Uh, most of you probably know how to do this, but for you the, out there that don't, hey, this is how I do mine. Let me know how you do yours. We'll see you next time.